Hi, welcome all of you on platform of Europedia Education, that platform, dedicated platform, which is preparing you for uh, uh, various interviews related to jobs and higher education, etc. So nowadays, you know, uh, there is a opportunity ISRO. Many of you have got calls from ISRO, and the interview is only decisive factor in ISRO. So for research organizations like BARC, DRDO and ISRO, interview is very, very important. In fact, for ISRO, interview is the only criteria. Written exam score is not counted in the final selection now. So those 2,500 students who have got call from now interview from ISRO, they should take the interview very, very seriously because that will only uh, affect their next selection. Now I will be, there are three branches they have called electronics, computers and mechanical. So uh, electronics, uh, video, Kalasar already made it. What are the most important topics? Let me tell you something about mechanical first, uh, which is my domain. So mechanical engineering, may you people should be very good in some subjects like uh, basic thermodynamics, fluid mechanics, uh, strength of material, heat transfer. These are the four most important subjects. That is for ISRO also and BARC also they ask you five subjects. So these four are to be named. These four subjects are uh, to be named. So let me repeat again, uh, thermodynamics, uh, heat transfer, fluid mechanics and uh, your strength of material. These are the basic subjects in mechanical engineering which everybody should know for any interview. Now uh, you see when you go for interview, sometime they ask you about uh, your uh, favorite subjects, uh, sometime they will not ask you. So if they ask you your favorite subjects, you can mention these subjects. But if they don't ask you the subjects, even then these are the uh, basically subjects you are to prepare. Sometimes they will ask you questions from those subjects which you have not prepared. Let's say he started asking you something from production engineering which you have not prepared and you do not know anything about that. In that situation, you can say that, sir, I'm sorry, sir, I, I have not gone through uh, the welding or casting or manufacturing or uh, uh, forming. You can say that. But in case of thermodynamics, fluid mechanics, heat transfer, strength of material, you cannot say that. These are the most important subjects. And if you say, sir, I have not gone through fluid mechanics, they will not accept it. And another reason why I'm telling you to revise these four subjects is that uh, these are the four subjects, uh, the expert of which surely will be sitting there. So you can be sure that somebody who is taking the interview, somebody will be there who will be knowing these subjects. So certainly he's going to ask you a question from that. So <clears throat> suppose you leave this strength of material and there's an expert of strength of material, he's going to ask you from there. So this is what I'm saying, like you need to revise these four subjects and go through in detail. Now on your PDA education channel, we have uh, kept marathon videos for three subjects out of these. Like strength of material, fluid mechanics and thermodynamics, marathon videos are there on your PDA education channel and you can uh, basically go for that. You can uh, revise that. There are six, six, seven, seven hour subjects and it will be very good if you revise from there and all the basic things are covered in those. You need to listen to them uh, repeatedly again and again. And I'm very sure if you go through that, then your preparation will be very good. So just revise that, go through that and I'm very sure you can answer questions on the basis of that. Keep watching for other updates related to interviews in ISRO and uh, other such organization. And your PD education is a channel which is preparing you very well for that. Thank you.